Well, good day YouTube and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. Today you have the Rhino and we're going to look at a beer. Today's beer was uh, delivered to me today, actually. Um, so this is from Font Hill from the Cayman Kettle Beer Works. This is their ORP. Their ORP, or Orange Rye Porter. So I'm actually really intrigued by an orange rye porter. I'll be 100% honest with you. An orange rye porter really actually gets me, gets me, gets my motor running. 6% alcohol. Uh, came in Kettle Beer Works in Font Hill. Again, 25 Pelham Town Square, Font Hill, Ontario. The kettle to the came was brought to brew tasty beers for those who sought, where pallets are tested, Thirsts quenched and flavors and flavor alerts came in Kettle Beer Works. Sounds like my son's going to sleep in my bed right now. I hear him moving around, and now that he hears me downstairs, he's probably like, sweet, bed is free. Uh, here's my only real whine about the Cayman Kettle. They're uh, cans, they're crawlers. And I've never really had crowlers from anywhere else, so I don't know if it's a normal thing. But a lot of them are really hard to get underneath that. Uh, it's really hard to get underneath that uh, tab on a lot of these crowlers. Wow, that is the coolest color. The head looked awesome. The beer actually has a really nice color as it hits the glass, and then it fades into the regular porter-esque color. So, there we are. Look at that beer in the spigaloo. Uh, stout glass, beautiful black, no, mahogany brown, uh, mahogany brown with a little bit of haze beer. The head, a mocha head, looks great, smell, oh my god, that smells delightful. Oh my god, it does, it smells delightful, it actually smells like one of the uh, Terry's chocolate oranges. Lots of orange, sweet and bitter, um, lots of chocolate, a little bit of coffee, a little bit of caramel, a little bit of roast. Oh, it smells delightful. Oh, we gotta try this. Cheers, guys. Oh. Okay, so when I when I did their uh, their chili porter, I said their porter actually tasted like a really good porter, and this this still holds that. This is a really solid porter. Um, if if it if it wasn't like light to medium, like just starting the medium spectrum bodied, I would say this is more stout. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, there is there is caramel, there's molasses, there's a nice coffee flavor, there's a nice dark roasted flavor. Really, it reminds me of maybe uh, more like say a robust porter than a, than a regular porter. Then you get. A little dryness on the back end that has just the tiniest touch of a spicy zip, uh, most likely rye, uh, just giving that drying, drying kind of spicy sensation, I, which I love out of rye. Uh, truthfully, caraway rye is my favorite rye. I'm not getting any caraway seed, but that's okay.
and just the subtle touch of almost like a, a pure Florida orange, almost, almost uh, like very subtle, hidden under the hidden under the coffee and caramel and and roast and and everything else. But there's this slight smooth, <coughs> excuse me, slight smooth, almost Tropicana like uh, sensation going on in there, flavor wise. Oh, it's such a nice little beer. Now, I don't think that it's a beer that you would love if, say, you don't like porters. But if you are somebody that likes porters, this is a great little beer. It's very, very appealing for me. I just I, the, the smell of orange was more was more apparent than the taste, but I, I do kind of wish the orange was a little more out there. I I wish there was a little more of a citrus flavor in there, but that is a splendid, splendid porter with some splendid flavors. Just as I said, I wish there was a little bit more. Um, so the Orp. The Orp's going to get a 9 out of 10. Uh, I really enjoy the Orp. Uh, so the Orp is Orp and Fantastic, and the Orp needs a fucking board of dance, motherfucker! I'm not going to chug this. Because, one, I want to take a picture of it. And two... I'm going to watch a TV show before I go to bed, and I want something to drink while I watch that TV show, and that's going to be this. So thank you guys. Bye. Stop taking...